USA, America's favorite cable network. From Television City in Hollywood, this is the $25,000 Pyramid. Today's special guests are, from Scarecrow and Mrs. King, Martha Smith. And from Gimme a Break, Howard Martin. Your host is Dick Clark. Thank you, Bob, very much. Welcome to the uh, $25,000 Pyramid on a Tuesday. And uh, this is the day where I hope the sun is shining and all is well in your life. But... No matter what you're doing for the next half hour, if you'll join us, play along, maybe we'll make somebody... We can't make them real rich, but we can make them win a lot of money in a short length of time. Martha, it's your responsibility to do all of this. Oh, no. Yes. We'll do it. I said to you earlier when we were staying, Beth, you got to run back upstairs into your dressing room and put something colorful on. That is... <laughs> mm, mm. That'll glasses. perk up your day. Mm -hmm. Robin Eaton, what do you do, please? I'm a graphic artist. We yes. We welcome you here. Uh, Howard, though you are not colorful, you are... No, I... A picture of, uh, what, what would I say, conservative. symphony in gray. <laughs> All right, you got it. Your partner is doing very well, Joanne Schuber, who's our teacher and has won how much money so far? 4500 And 50 And 50 I oh, think. I hope. Is that sure? Sure. Yeah. Well, don't lose those extra little I pennies won't. along the way. The winner circles over here, folks. You go over there and you try for the majority of the money that you might win, though you might win a bonus along the way. That's where you win ten or $25,000. And this is where the game starts. We have back talk. It all adds up. Where there's smoke. Play it by ear. That little squirt. Do you believe in magic? And we have uh, a 7-Eleven in the game there somewhere, Martha. I don't know where it is right now. I'm going to take a guess. Where do you think it is? I know where it is. All right. Yeah, it's do you believe in magic? Let's see. Do you believe in magic? Yes. Do you? Turn I it, do. folks. No. Nope. It's oh. not. <laughs> it is not. Woman's intuition didn't fly today. <laughs> Describe these things associated with a magician. Things associated with a magician. Ready. Go. This is my sleeve. Yes. Uh, you do this to the box with a woman in it. You. Oh, saw. Mm-hmm. All right. You wrap around your neck a scarf. Yes. Uh, the white bird. He pulls out. Oh, a out. dove. Yes. Uh, a magic blank. It's one. What he does. It's called a the, trick. Yes. Uh, the famous magician who escaped from Houdini. Everything. Yes. Uh, this is the person that aids uh, the woman. It's called a. The assistant. Yes. That's it. Uh, seven out of seven. <laughs> Good score, ladies. Can't get any better. Howard, of the five remaining subjects, now let's see. The, the woman's intuition didn't work the last time. What does man's intuition do? Where is the 7 Eleven? Uh, let's do where there's smoke. Let's see if that's it. Uh, we we Gee, failed, that's failed beautifully two <laughs> times in a row here. These are things that are burned or have been burned. Things that are burned been. or have been burned. Okay. Ready, go. Uh, you light it at dinner. Candle. Uh, for a barbecue, you light... Charcoal. You eat a... D uh, supper, dinner... dinner uh, meal. Uh, the capital of Georgia. Uh, Atlanta. And you throw out the garbage or the... Trash. Uh, you light this and it has an aroma. Incense. Uh, she was burned at the stake. Uh, Joan of Arc. 7-7. Seven, seven. This is the kind of game I like, folks. We could cook up a 21-21 here and somebody can win $5,000 in bonus money, as you know. Uh, we have back talk. It all adds up. Play it by ear. That little squirt. What's your pleasure, Robin? Okay, Martha and I are going to play it by ear. Play it by ear. All right, describe okay. these things associated with a piano. Things okay. associated with a piano. Ready, go. The person who... Composer? ...helps you learn how to play. Uh, a music teacher. Sits there and help. Yes. Uh, oh. Uh, the things you push with your foot. Pedals. The guy with the candelabra. Very glitzy Morris, performer. Morris, uh, uh, Liberace. Right. The thing you sit on. The bench, the stool. Right. Not flat, but not flat. Sharp. Right. You have to, to get to Carnegie Hall, Practice. you have to. Right. Uh, a baby. Graham. All right, right under the gun. 14 point perfect score. Joanne Schuber, you see anything there you like? Well, let's try it. All adds up. Okay, the 7-Eleven is still in the game, folks. Describe these things that are counted. 
things that are counted. <coughs> Ready, go. How old you are? How many? Your age. How many? Mm -hmm. And uh, when you're dieting, you count these. Calories. Mm -hmm. And pennies, nickels, and dimes are? Coins. Mm -hmm. And you cast your ballot or your? Vote. Mm -hmm. And you count these to go to sleep. Sheep. Mm -hmm. And all the people that live in the country are at? Census. The, the population. Mm -hmm. And and football game, five to five is the? Score. Mm -hmm. All right, 14-14. <laughs> Perfect game. Now, we're done. Folks, we've been trying real hard to find the 7-Eleven. I mean, know it's a 50-50 it shot. You say you know where it is? We know where it is. We've known Pick it up. Where that is it? That little squirt. Mm -hmm. That little squirt? You yeah! got it. <laughs> You're going to give Martha? Yes, please. Uh, describe these things that squirt. Things that squirt. Ready? Okay. Mm -hmm. Go. Uh, not a lime, but a lemon. In the morning, you take a shower. A fire blank to put out fires at the street. No, on the street. The big Hydrant. Thing. Right. Uh, you put it. You slice it for a salad. You use a. Uh, you, it's red. No, you slice it. Oh, it's tomato. It um, okay, this is a lot of water that spurts up in in a park. It's called a fountain. Right. Uh, hair. Psst. Hairspray. Yes. All right. This is in uh, the national park. You have old uh, geyser. Yes. Yes. Robin Eaton, you've won $1,100 in bonus money. You have set the mark there at 21 points. We hope the other team gets 21. That means the contestant who breaks the tie will win $5,000, okay? Who's going to give on the other side? Oh, uh, I'm going to give. Describe these words that are spelled the same way, backwards or forwards. These words are spelled the same way, backwards or forwards. We need 21 for a tie. Ready, go. Uh, 12 o'clock. Noon. A baby wears a... Bib. Uh, a sister in the Catholic Church. None. A uh, little bow. Peep. Uh, a joke or a... Uh, you a put this in somebody's mouth so they can't talk. A muzzle, a uh, gag. Uh, an Eskimo paddles his... Uh, canoe, um, uh, a kayak. Mm -hmm. And uh, they catch you speeding with... A ticket, a no, trap, radar. Electronic. radar. Yes, it's 2121. It's been a long time since we've had a perfect score. Wipe out that perfect score. We'll break the tie. The tiebreaker contestant wins $5,000 before we go to the winner's circle. Howard and Joanne, do you want to describe words that begin with the letter Q or the letter Y? Q. Q. Uh -huh. Howard does it? Uh, okay. okay. <coughs> describe these words that begin with the letter Q. Ready. Go. A duck says... Quack. Uh... Quiet. Uh, not a pint, but... Quart. And I don't like this job, I... Quit. And four musicians. Quartet. And I've got to slake my thirst. I've got to... Quench. And uh, I have measles, so I'm in... Quarantine. That's got it. <laughs> you take the 21 seconds that's left on their clock. Move it over. Martha, are you going to give on this one? Yes. You need mm -hmm. seven out of seven and less than 21... I beg your pardon, 20 seconds, I am corrected. Words that begin with the letter Y. Ready. Mm -hmm. Go. Ah! Yell. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a form of exercise. You meditate and you do... Yoga. Yes. Uh, not Harvard, but... Yale. Mm -hmm. uh, all right, this is what you use to make bread dough. Yeast. Uh, this is the Barbra Streisand movie where she played a young Yanko. boy. Yanko. Uh, this is like a sweet potato. Thank you. I have... Oh, Joanne, oh. you've won the try at the $10,000, and you've won $5,000 in bonus money. So Let's go to the winner's yeah. circle. Yeah. Almost forgot the rub down. I mean, can't do that. That's, that would be a jinx, all right? For $10,000, folks, do the same. Just do what you're doing. You're only, uh, what, $50 short of $10,000 in winnings now, so we can almost double that this time around. Here is your first subject. Go. Frankenstein. Monsters. I've got to fly this plane, and I... What I'm... the pilot would say. Uh, necklaces, bracelets. Jewelry. A funny red nose. What a clown would wear. Uh, a blouse. My shirt. Things you tuck in. Things uh, you button. Things you wear. 
a nurse, a doctor. People in a hospital? A nun. People in uniform? A priest. People that go into a training? A boy scout. People, uh... A boy scout. Uh... Uh... People a in philanthropist. People that help other people? <laughs> Sit right here a second. Don't run away. Howard wants you to sit for a moment. Here, we'll, we'll, we'll tidy him up a little bit here. You ever met this guy before? Yes. <laughs> Would you like Crazy to introduce him? Yes, this is my wonderful husband, Jerry. Jerry, congratulations again. I said you would be $50 short of uh, 10000 going in. I, I think you're $50,000 short of $20,000 oh. winnings. Don't trust my math, but it's pretty close to that. Oh. How are you, Howard? I'm He's fine now. Wonderful. That's how he is. He's wonderful. You had your 35 seconds to get that last one. Were you the least bit nervous? Uh -huh. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> All right. You relax a little bit. We'll be right back. Seventy-seven hundred. Time to roll once again with the twenty-five thousand dollar pyramid. Joanne, you have won nineteen thousand five hundred and fifty dollars. I was only off by four hundred. What you know? I'll take mere it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I remembered that fifty dollars, and I forgot there were a few hundred missing in there. Pretty That's good winning right. so far. Robin, you've won the bonus money of eleven $1 hundred dollars. You and Howard will start the game, and we have food for all. Take it all in. Uh, a day in court. Where are you going? Point the way. Sweet dreams. And we have the mystery seven this time. You're gonna love it. Get seven out of seven, we'll send you to Rome, Italy for a little vacation. Oh. Howard, where do we start? Well, you have to promise me that there are no croissants in it, and we'll take food for all. <laughs> <laughs> These are people who are connected with eating. People, people who, are who are connected, connected with, with eating. eating. Ready, go. Uh, Adam and Eve. Uh, she sat on a tuffet. Little Miss Muffet. A person who eats no meat. A vegetarian. Uh, she's the television, uh... Julia Child. <laughs> a person who eats another person. Oh, a cannibal. And the guy who seats you at the restaurant. The maitre d'. And a person who really knows good food. A gourmet. Seven-pointer. Dynamite start. Joanna Martha, you've got your work cut out. What'll it be? Sweet dreams. Sweet dreams. Describe these things you go to bed with. Things you go to bed with. Ready? <laughs> go. Right. Uh, you read a... A book. Not your wife, but your husband. Oh, I've got a... Headache. Uh, your grandmother makes this for the bed to keep you warm. A uh, big cup patchwork, Afghan patchwork quilt. quilt. Uh, a cup of hot... Chocolate tea. Another milk. one for chocolate. Cocoa. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is my little uh, animal. It's oh, a... it's teddy bear. Yes. Uh, you wear in your hair to roll it. C rollers. Curlers. Curlers. Mm -hmm. Curlers. That's another seven-pointer. <laughs> we could have another tiebreaker. We get to another 21-21. We'll give two five thousands away today. That would be dandy. Robin, what would you like? Well, let's hope it's to Rome. Where are you going? Where are you going? To Rome? To Rome? Oh. Not this time. Okay. Describe these things that people run away from. Things people run away from. Okay. Ready. Go. Uh, black and white. A bee, a bump. Uh, not summer, but... Winter. Federal income... Tax. Uh, you go there every day to learn. School. Hmm? Boom! Atomic. An explosion. No, an atomic... Bomb. Right. He takes your wallet in uh, the park. A uh, mugger. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's uh, lots of rocks tumbling down a mountain. Avalanche. Mm -hmm. That's got it. There you go. 14-7. Another perfect game in the works. Joanne, one out of three shot on the Mystery 7. Uh, take it all in. Let's see if that's it. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Come up with 14 points and you win your stuff. A very nice vacation trip. Here's your 30 seconds. Ready and go. Uh, you dry with a towel. Mm -hmm. uh, you throw this at a wedding. Uh, the bouquet. Um, minute made, minute... Um, Orange juice. The, the little grains, Chinese. Oh, cook. rice. Yeah. Um, Kleenex is a 
Tissue. Mm -hmm. um, the pie, first you make the bottom part of the pie. Crust. The, mm -hmm. And the cigarette has a little thing which strains out Filter. the nicotine. Uh -huh. And the roller hmm, that goes down. Coaster. Uh -huh. And this is inside my cranium. Is my, mm -hmm. That's got it. <laughs> Things That Absorb was the title. And you have won a trip for two to Rome. You'll have a six-night stay in Rome, Italy. It's 1414. Howard and Robin. Which one? A day in court. You're going to give? Yes. Describe these things associated with tennis. Things associated with tennis. Uh -huh. Okay. Ready. Go. The thing you hit with. A racket. Mm -hmm. Not singles, but? Doubles. You? Serve. Right. Uh, he does it for a living. A pro. Mm -hmm. A foot, you step on the line, it's not your... Paul. He's the nasty-tempered player. Uh, Nastasi? No, he's the... He's John McEnroe. Right. Uh, you go on a world... Tour. Mm -hmm. 21 points. Let's work our way into a tie here, ladies. Who's going to give Martha? Describe these things that have a point. Things that have a point. You need them all for a tie. Okay. Ready? Go. Uh, a knife, a spoon, and a fork. A rose bush has a thorn. Mm -hmm. uh, a circle, a square, and a triangle. Mm -hmm. uh, all right, uh, the secretary puts it in the a file. Right. Uh, Dracula has fangs, teeth. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, the knife has a blade. Right. Uh, this is the plant that prickles you. Um, uh, uh, it's a the desert of cactus. Yes. 21 21. Oh, oh. oh no. <laughs> Wipe the score off. We start over again. This, I think, is a first. Whoever breaks the tie today will have two tiebreakers in one day. Is that true? Did we not have a tiebreaker today? Yes. Uh-huh. Son yes. of a gun. Yes. Words that begin with the letter R or G. R. R? R? You give. Okay. R. Okay, Martha, you're giving R. Yeah. Words <laughs> that begin with the letter R. Ready. Mm -hmm. Go. Rooster. Mm -hmm. <laughs> On my cheeks, I put rouge. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's a type of bread that has a grain. Rye. Mm -hmm. uh, the Texan lives out on the range. Uh, no. Uh, Ranch. Yes. <laughs> okay, on the boat to keep it even. You Rudder. A, mm -hmm. uh, when a fruit is ready to be picked, right. it's... Help me, help me! You Rescue. Need to... Okay. Good thing. Take the amount of time that Joanna Monta have left on their clock. It's 21 seconds, folks. Howard, you'll have 21 to come up with 7 out of 7 in last time. Words that begin with the letter G. Ready, go. You put your car in the... Garage. Uh, an animal with a long neck. Giraffe. In Venice, you ride in a... Gondola. Uh, the TV, you read it. Guide. Uh, they chop your head off with Guillotine. the... Guillotine. And you make Hungarian... Goulash. And uh, apples... Uh... <laughs> Joanne, you've won $5,000 in bonus money. You're going for twenty-five right now. Murder, She Wrote on USA Tonight at 8. Ladies win this $25,000, and it's a possible $39,550. Good luck. Here is your first subject. Go. The sofa, the table. Things in the living room. You go to church. Uh, what you do on Sunday? You don't. Uh, the hooting horns, the hats, the birthday cake. At a party, birthday party. Uh, your old doors, your shoes, uh, wooden floors. Things you sand, uh, things um, you refinish. Things you polish. Old wooden floors. Polish. Wax. Old, unoiled doors. Things that are rough, things that are scraped. Unoiled doors. Scuffed. It's creak. Unoiled creak. hinges. Yes. Uh, the dollar button, the drawer, the money drawer. Cash register. Hurry, hurry. Uh, ladies in elegant gowns. Uh, things at a wedding. Oh, sorry, love. I don't imagine that could have worked for Take another second. Go on, take another five seconds. Just give it a try. 
This one? Uh, I don't know. Um, you only had 10 seconds, that's why I said hurry. Oh, yeah, yeah. And by the time you'd put 10 seconds worth of clues on, I doubt whether you've gotten sophisticated things. Oh. That's one that needs a little more what development. What you say for that? I have no idea. Come on, you always know $750, I'm going to the commercial. I'm okay. Gonna well, yeah. I'll be right back. <laughs> Folks, we've got to wrap it up and say goodbye. Martha, we'll see you tomorrow. Joanne, you've won $25,300 a trip for two to Rome. Oh, I love it. <laughs> and Howard, we will see you tomorrow. Robin, you've won $1,100 in bonus money. And normally you say goodbye at that point, but you played two perfect games today, 21-21, and you lost by a point the chance to go to the winner's circle. So uh, the judge, in the kindness of his heart, and the producer thought it would be nice if we sent you and a friend to Mexico on a little vacation as a bar. <laughs> Thank you very much for joining us. We'll see you tomorrow for now, Dick Clark. So long. For well, winning today's Mr. Seven, Joanne Schubert, you'll receive a Roman holiday for two. We'll fly you and your guests round trip coach from Los Angeles to Italy for a six night stay at a fine hotel in Rome. Enjoy a continental breakfast daily and a sightseeing trip to the Fountain of Trevi. Congratulations. And for playing two perfect games, Robin Eaton will jet you and your companion round trip coach from Los Angeles to Cancun, Mexico for a six night stay with some meals at Fiesta Americana on the beautiful Caribbean Hacienda style hotel with deluxe rooms are in continental traditional cuisine. Fiesta Americana, Cancun, congratulations. Some of our contestants will receive the automatic shut-off iron. It not only beeps to remind you it's on, it shuts itself off automatically. Black & Decker ideas at work. An ambush, all the romantic beauty of a sunny garden captured to win contemporary compelling fragrance ambush by Dana. Plus, the adventures of the masked team take off of these dramatically styled coordinates, each with a colorful graphic illustration boys will love by Dobie. Also, Heinz Homestyle Gravy made with real meat juices and seasoned just right. Heinz Homestyle Gravy, so close to homemade. Plus, from the Eureka Company, the new quick up cordless and lightweight with its own wall-mounted recharging stand. Perfect for quick cleanups. And from out of the ocean comes the unique blended seafood. New delicacies now in the frozen food section. Now, watch out for the whammy. It's the risk you run on your way to big bucks on Press Your Luck. Right after this USA Update, next.